What is going on everybody? My name is Jake as you know and welcome to the pre bracket show for Call of Duty Ghost Anaheim 2014. <laughs> Anaheim is in five or six days, I think. I think it starts um, Friday, so that would be June 20th. So, yeah, it's about five days away. And today we are going to be looking at the championship bracket for the 11 teams consisting of seed number one, Evil Geniuses, then Opti Gaming, Envy, Face Black, Curse AU, or Curse Kangaroos, as I put them on there. Um, Epsilon, Curse, Black, Phase Red, TCM, Denial, and Team Caliber. Now, we're just going to go ahead and start and go through the bracket. Going round one by one by one, and then we're going to go down to the loser's bracket and do that for round one, and then two, 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 three, three, eight. I'm gesturing with my hands. Just picture what I'm gesturing, even though you have no clue what I'm gesturing. Okay, we're going to go ahead and look at this first match right here, which would be Phase Red versus TCM. I know that TCM is a very, very good... TCM and Epsilon are the two EU teams that stand out from everyone else. There's a few other notable ones, but TCM and Epsilon has always been the number one. And Phase Red with their, um, what is it? I feel like they already have a roster ship. I don't know this, this is obviously a rumor, but I feel like they already have a roster change planned, but they can't do it till um after Anaheim because their roster's are already locked in. So I don't think that they're going to be doing well. They don't have much hype. They don't have... They, ha they have... If they... If they... I don't think that they can win this. TCM is a strong EU team, and Phase Red's just unstable right now. They don't know what... I feel they just don't know what they're doing in classic they're classic classic he needs he needs to he needs to move on it's a it's a good statement so I'm gonna go ahead and say that TCM is gonna take this pretty handedly 3-1 maybe losing um the blitz or first dom to phase red um yeah it's gonna be at 3-1 TCM that's a mitt 3-1 Oh, there you go. Submit scores. There you go. Three to one. And now we're gonna go down to Curse Black versus Denial. Denial used to be erupt. They were a very solid online team. They got a very hefty start at the beginning of the league, but then they started to falter. Not when going on one and two nights and a few two and ones. They never really went three and zero. Oh. But I feel like um they are strictly an online team. And they they will do good. I have I have hope in them because I've seen them play online, and I don't think it's all online, but they're they're um underestimated. But Curse Black, I've watched them play too, and they just they just know what they're doing. They got they got some good people, but I think this will be a close match. Three two to Curse Black, and I don't know. It's gonna it's obviously gonna go down to the game five S and D. Denial's probably going to end up taking um, either both of the doms or no, they um, they might they're probably going to win the search and the blitz if I had to if I'd had to if I would have to guess, then Curse Black's going to pull it out for the last search. Um, now we're going to go ahead, huh? You know, I am going to actually change my mind. Can I? Ah, oh. I'm going to change my mind on this. I think that Denial will actually beat Curse Black. Just with their, um, I know Denial's S&D game specific, both of their S&D games are very good, but Denial specifically, I don't know, their S&D stands out to me. I'm going to go ahead and put them through. And now we're going to have Epsilon and Team. This is going to be a very good match, for sure. I'm not sure, okay, I'm going to think about this. TK, they're... They're t they're too hyped right now. They are just on a roll. They can't be stopped. They will um, you know, I'm gonna actually have to say that's gonna be a three one to TK, because what is it? Epsilon is another strong EU team, stronger than TCM in my opinion, but um, Team Caliber, their Dom game is too strong. They're gonna um, they're either gonna lose the Search or the Blitz, then they're gonna clean up on that Dom. They're going to win the first Dom, 
lose the search, maybe. And then, no, they won't lose the search. They could lose the search. They lose the search, they win the blitz, and they win the dumb. They'll probably lose the dumb. No, Jake. No, they won't. I'm going back on myself. Team Caliber. Dom 1, win. Search 1, win. Blitz, lose. Dom 2, win. That's how it's going to go. TK's going to 3-1 Epsilon. Okay. Now we're going to go ahead and move down. Oh, we can't go down here, can we? Okay. Evil Geniuses, TCM, you know... EG's got a lot to prove. They're gonna, they're gonna step up. They're gonna be like, no, we're they're gonna get off to a hot start. They are the number one team. They're gonna win the first three matches easy against TCM. Sorry, TCM, but you know you're gonna have to go down there and face your partner team, Epsilon. Oh, that's gonna be a fun one. Face Black versus Curse Kangaroos. Oh, I really want. I really, I have not watched much of Curse I use, but all I know is that they're really good, and, um, they, they were seated fifth, they got fifth at champs, well, SB, or a lot of players from Phase Black got fourth, so, you know, I'm gonna go ahead, and just because of that factor, I'm gonna go ahead and say that Phase Black's gonna take it 3-2, but it's gonna, it's gonna be a good game, and it can go either way, but for right now, I sort of want Phase Black to win that. Face Black should win, um, they should win the Dom, they could win the Search, I don't think they will. They, hi, ah, going back on myself again. I'm going to say Face Black wins 3-1, because they're going to, they're going to win the Dom. They, they won't, they probably won't win the Search, because of, um, the AU's aggressive style. Um, the Blitz, they could win, or they couldn't, but I'm going to go ahead and say they do. Yeah, Face Black's a strong blitz team, and they're going to win the Dom too. And just kangaroos, they're just gonna hop on down to that losers bracket. Okay, so now we have Optic Gaming Denial. I think that this one should be a pretty boring match, in all honesty. Optic Gaming, they're obviously gonna be on a hot streak. They're gonna be just like EG. They're gonna be. They're gonna try to start off hot. Now, NV versus TK. This is um. They played. They played at um X Games, so this is gonna be a matchup. But you know, I think TK they're gonna um are gonna win the Dom. Envy will win the search, and then TK, and then Envy's gonna win the um Blitz, and then TK is gonna win the next Dom and the next search. They're gonna pull out that last search. Let's go TK. Oh God. Okay, so now we move down to the losers bracket. We got Envy versus Phase Red here, okay? So Envy versus Phase Red. Envy is just a strong squad. They aren't gonna be stopped that early. Phase Red's gonna be out. Like they're gonna yeah, they're gonna get first rounded. Um Envy's gonna win you know, I'm gonna give Phase Red the first Dom. But Envy'll get that second Dom locked down, that's it. And Phase Red is going to be out early. Curse Kangaroos versus Curse Black. Oh, the Curse Showdown. Oh, that's funny. But, oh, I really wanted Curse Black to go somewhere, but they really aren't going to be able to compete with um, Curse Kangaroos. Or Curse AU. I'm going to keep calling them Curse Kangaroos. They're going to win it. But, um, Curse AU is going to... Curse Black could take the, um, the first Dom. But then they're going to win the search. And what's next? Next would be Blitz. They're gonna win the Blitz, and Curse Black might win the Dom, but they're gonna win the. Yeah, that's gonna. That could be a close game. I feel like it'll be a close game. It could go either way, but Curse AU is gonna win that. TCM Epsilon. I am heavily favoring Epsilon here. I just think that Epsilon's gonna blow TCM out. Unlike um. Oh, I forget who went farther at champs. I think Epsilon did, but either way, um. Epsilon is, they are a stronger team than a TCM. Epsilon's number one right now, TCM's probably number two. So we're going to have Epsilon just 3-1 them. I don't watch them much, so this is mostly guesswork on the EU side. Now we're going to move down to Denial versus Envy. Envy, number three seed, they should clean that up pretty easy against Denial. Sorry guys, you're going to go out. But Denial, they're going to win, ooh, 
Envy's a... I think that Envy's gonna lose the search. They're gonna get the Dom. These guys are gonna get the search. They could get the Blitz. And then Envy should finish out the last search. But that, that actually, I think, could be a close series. I move down to Curse Kangaroos versus Epsilon. Two of the non-Native American teams two of the non-North American teams facing off, and we got, um, you know, Curse AU, they're gonna, they're gonna stomp, they're gonna stomp Epsilon, you know, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna, you know, I don't, I don't want to say 3-0, probably should not say 3-0, but let's go, I'm just gonna win the, I, I don't follow either of those teams, I just know that Curse Kangaroos are gonna win the searches, and I'm just gonna give Epsilon a map. They're gonna win the first Dom or the first Blitz or something. But that should be it. Okay, we got Evil Geniuses versus Phase Black. This is one that I really didn't want to do because I don't. I am going to get plenty of hate and disagreement from this, but it's a little controversial. But Phase Black is going to win it three two. They're gonna win um the f one of the Doms, the Blitz. And EG's gonna win the search. Actually, no. No, Phase Black's gonna win the first Dom, the search. EG's gonna win the Blitz, and then they're gonna win the Dom again. So I think they're gonna 3 1 EG. They could 3 1 EG, because no one. EG doesn't lose on the fifth map. They have to be 3 0 or 3 1. They can't, they can't lose 3 2. That just does not happen. It's wrong. And we got TK versus Optic. This is like a close very close match. It's going to be 3-2. I don't know who to. But, um, Optic, I'm going to say TK gets the first Dom. Optic's going to get the search. Blitz is going to go to Optic, and the next Dom might go to TK, but Optic's going to finish out the third search. That I'm, I'm going to go quick and decide that really quick. Quickly. And now we got EG versus Envy, the team that Envy will never, ever beat. You know, it's going to be a quick 3-0 by EG. Envy's going to get knocked out pretty easily. easily. And he, Envy is out. So we have TK versus Cursed Kangaroos. TK is going to pull this through, but um, they're going to win both the Doms and they could win the Blitz. But I'm, I'm, I'm going to say that it goes to the last search and TK pulls it through against the kangaroos so now we go to eg versus tk now this is gonna be a very very close match and i'm sort of an anti eg right now just because i want them to lose but i don't think they can lose they can't lose to tk for a second time they're gonna be like studying up on their film and tk just won't be able to hang it'll go last map but it might be a 6-0 search map in the for the last map, but EG is going to pull that through. Now we got Optic versus Phase Black. Now Phase Black matches up much better against Evil Geniuses than they do Optic, but so just because of that, I feel like Optic's going to be able to um, use their better teamworks and they're just going to pull through. They're going to play more as a team. They're going to be. Um, I think they should. That'll be a little anticlimactic semifinal, or yeah, I think that's a semifinal, but or just final. But I think Optics should be able to pull that out. They should. They might lose the first Dom. They're gonna win the search. They're gonna win the Blitz, and then they're gonna win. Yeah, I think Optics can go down 0-1 and then come back with three more. Then we got Phase Black versus EG. Now EG is not gonna let Phase Black. Um, lose again, or beat them again. I'd like to say that they would, but nope, that's not gonna happen. So we go ahead and say that EG is going to pull this out three to two. Yes. Oh, that's why I meant to say EG is gonna beat Phase Black three to two, and it's going to it's gonna be a good series, I think. But just like the TK, they're gonna like sweep them in the last search phase black um they're gonna win they might win the um second search and the blitz that sounds about right so now you got optic versus eg the match everyone's wanted to see and i i'm gonna be an optic fanboy 
can go ahead and say that Optic does not let them win, and I think it's going to be a 3-2. I know I said that EG can't lose 3-2, but this is a mm, this is a tournament of miracles and ridiculous things. So we're going to go ahead and say Optic beats them 3-2, and we have, uh, uh, I think that's about it. Optic's going to win the first Dom, the Search, and then EG's going to win the Dom, or the Blitz, the next Dom in Optic Game is going to close out on the third search. And, you know, if Evil Geniuses is going to get this far, they have to have all their players playing, like, number, like, really good. They have to play, they have to play very, very well. They can't have any Karma or Krim choking again. Can't have them going 12 and 24 in a Dom. So we go ahead and have Opta Gaming in first place, Evil Geniuses, second place, Phase Black, third place, fourth place would be TK. I I'm I'm a TK fan. I just don't think they can pull it out against EG again. Fifth place is going to be Envy and the Cursed Kangaroos. Seventh place is going to be Epsilon Denial. Ninth is Curse Black, Phase Red, and TC. Oh, I'm sad that I put Curse Black. I want Curse Black to get farther than that. I think they can. They could, um... You know, if I did another show, I might... If I did another bracket, I might put Curse Black through against Denial. But, well, that is... That is the bracket show, and that is what my predictions are. You can go ahead and put your predictions in the comments. Go ahead and go to challenge.com. C H A L L O N G E dot com, and you can make your own bracket. And I'm going to put the teams in the description, the seeds. So, yeah, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you guys next video if it's within the next eight months.